Hello, so this is my review of the Sitachi USB-C adapter. It's pretty good. I have a couple complaints, two complaints, and they're pretty major. One is this micro SD slot. You, when you get this, and if you if you have a S, micro SD like for, from your drone or something, and you put it in. It's very easy to push it in all the way and have it get stuck or have it pushed in cricket to where it's like this and you would need pliers to pull it out. I've seen a video of a guy on YouTube who didn't know which direction to put it in, grab some pliers to yank it out, put it in the opposite way and it worked. So as a reminder, micro SD make sure the cover is facing this direction so for me i put it in this direction but i accidentally pushed it too far in first i pushed it in here and it didn't read so i'm thinking okay push it in right here it still didn't read and then it got to here okay completely my fault but just to just to keep in mind, you might run into that because you might think that there's a, like a, a, a area where it keeps it from going beyond a certain point. Let's say, for example, like USB, USBs, you put it in, you know what direction it goes, and not only that, you put it in and it stops. Same with the SD. You put it in and it stops the micro however you put it in it just goes if you put pressure on this side it'll tip it this way and it's just a big big headache so keep that in mind if you do decide to buy this product I like the look of it I don't mind it it's just this this micro SD. I have a drone and I tried using this. The first time I put it in, it didn't read. I took it out, I put it in this SD card reader, put it in here, but it wouldn't read for some reason. I'm not sure. I thought maybe these little pins on the corner, Like maybe this had something to do with it. I don't know what it is, but I thought it may be that. So I kind of pushed this around, put it back in, still didn't read. So I figured, I don't know. Put the micro SD in here. First put it in like, I put it in like this. It didn't read. So I'm looking, oh, maybe it's not getting the contact. So I pushed it in a little further. Still didn't get the contact. And then when I pushed it in the third time, it just kind of, went in you can see it's jammed in there it's right there I'm using tweezers anything I can think of to pry this out because I got some footages on footage on it but yeah man what a headache so overall I don't know there's other products out there you might be better off getting the other one I mean, I'm surprised Hitachi didn't do some, like, I don't know, test on their own product before they shipped it out. Well, maybe, hopefully, on the next one, they add or they modify this area right here because this is garbage. Completely garbage. I can't even access this. So, if you get this, you get two USBs. The SD which goes in this direction your power and your micro SD which is very problematic another thing about this is that the connections it's okay but uh, it's not really it, when you plug it in it, it's not secure I mean when you're trying to yank this out it, it will torque it this way or you'll torque it that way you know what I mean? And it's just, it's not sturdy when it's connected to the laptop.
and it gets very very hot so one little micro SD secondly maybe some type of something here where when it sits it kind of like locks in or something gives it a more of a secure base I guess you can say I don't know and then third when you're transferring data or you running when you're running a editing software this gets so hot burning hot it's probably normal but those are three things that I notice about this it looks nice you, you need it if you own the new Mac man well that's it I hope this helps people who maybe look up and buying this.